Thrifty Tiffany and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul. Yes y'all, get excited because I have some amazing finds. If you're new here, I hope you stay, subscribe, become part of the family. If you're a current subscriber, thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. And if you haven't yet, y'all definitely check me out over on Instagram and TikTok at Thrifty Tiffany 35. Love for you to join me over there. So y'all, I hope everyone is doing well today and you're happy and you're healthy and things are going good for you. Today is Wednesday. And so we're halfway through the week, y'all. And it's getting closer and closer to Valentine's Day. And I'm so excited. I think Kai and I are going to do like a Galentine's Day. Excited for that. So you will see some items in here for that. But y'all, Dollar Tree is killing it right now. I cannot wait to share with you guys what I found. Also, grab you a drink. Grab you pen and paper so you can take notes on what to look out for at your local Dollar Tree. Because you're going to... I have a drink, y'all. Because you're going to want to take some notes. Um... It's a McDonald's cup, but it's just juice. It's not, I just, sometimes I reuse the cups just because I like it. You know, why not? But it is like a uh, berry punch, but one of the Minute Maid juices. So grab your drink. We're gonna, I love being in my room because I love being comfortable. Hopefully the camera doesn't move too much because it is on my mattress. But uh, here we go, we're gonna jump in. So let me show you first, I could not believe it. These are where the aluminum pans are. And they're red hearts. Like, this is so exciting. I got so excited. So I grabbed two of them. Again, Kai and I are probably going to do a, a Galentine's Day thing. We'll still celebrate Valentine's on Valentine's, but we'll probably do the Galentine's Day thing maybe this weekend. But this is my thought process for these. These are so cute. Dollar, I've never seen Dollar Tree come out with red hearts before. It just says heart cake pan. Of course, you can make cakes with it but I was thinking about doing a fudge brownie so like a brownie cake and then a cookie cake how fun would this be I got to I'm so excited and I love brownie cakes and um cookie cakes but let me show you what I got to go with it oh gosh I should have put it over here I got look at me I ain't gonna be able to find it there it is I got icing to go with it, and they still had the red icing. Hopefully my camera doesn't shake too much, y'all. Radiant red vanilla, and I got the classic vanilla. So icing on top of the brownies and the cookie cakes. Tell me this wasn't a perfect little set. So much fun. If you have kids and you wanna bake with them, this would be really, really fun, and it will taste really, really good. Because y'all know cookie cakes can kind of get expensive. If you go to Great American Cookie Company, um, they can get kind of expensive. So you can just make it at home. Why not? Or just make, they have cake mixes at Dollar Tree. Just make you a strawberry cake or vanilla cake. Make you a cake with that. I just got excited. So I picked up all these things. Also, they had more of this brand. And this is the soap. Let me find the other one. This is the... Australian Natural Cleansing Hand Soap, and it's the Lime Coconut. Oh my gosh, am I gonna be able to find it? Y'all have my stuff everywhere. It's not in this one, it's gotta be in this one. Here it is. I got my stuff all over my bed. But this is Lime and Coconut, and they are in the little, what do you call this? <laughs> Nozzle, push top, pump. I always forget it every single time. But I picked these up. Also, I got the big containers of the hand soap as well with the original scent. So when these are done, I can just use those to fill in here. Cause the shampoos had a pump on them, but the big, tall, skinny bottle was just like a refill bottle for these. So excited for that. If y'all see this brand, pick it up. And I have used the shampoo, the natural shampoo. I love it. It's a little like thin and a little kind of watery, but it works really, really well. It's a natural shampoo, so it's not doesn't have any additives or anything, but I love it. I really do love it. So pick those two up. Also found more boxers, y'all. Every time I see them, I'm gonna pick them up because I donate and I get I got three sizes, small, medium, and large. And this one looks like it's like graffiti and skateboarders. So how cool is that? And this is that really cool, crazy boxer brand. Really nice material, y'all. This is really good quality product. It's like that spandexy material, but I grabbed three of them because I'm, I'm going to scoop it up. If it's brand name like this and it's a really good product, I can always donate it. Family members that may need it, um, I got to pick them up. 
have to. Again, I wish Dollar Tree had this when my kids were young, but they didn't. But I, I, these are so cute. Love them. And these are originally usually at like TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross. I've seen them there before. So it's a really good deal to get them for $1.25. Next up, I could not believe I found these Halo Top, um, I thought, first of all, I thought it was ice cream that they put out on the shelves. And I'm like, oh gosh, that's going to be ruined. Nope. It's literally Halo Top Strawberry Light Cake Mix. And it's strawberry in the perfect time. Valentine's Day, if you're doing the pink and red theme, this is so cute. I cannot wait to taste it. So I don't know how it tastes. I don't know if it's good. But it says, pairs well with others. Try pairing with Halo Top Vanilla Bean Ice Cream. But all you need to put is three tablespoons of water. That's it. And it, a little cake, a little sweet treat at night when you're craving something. Or on Valentine's Day, if you're having a party, you can get each person their separate little cake mix. That's really nice. And this is only 170 calories. So I was really excited to find that. I love finding name brand items. Next, I found these the other day. And it was in where the frames were at. So it was laying on the shelf like this. So I thought it was just like a little frame that you hang up, but it's a box. It's a box of like um, positive notes or affirmations. It's by the brand True Story. And it's a nice like box. Of course they would be cutting grass when I do a video. Y'all, I've been waiting to do this video all day and now they do the grass. Oh, well, hopefully you guys can hear me. It says, you are all kinds of amazing. 24 cards to help you live your most positive life. And it gives you like ideas of what it, what they each say on there. Good energy coming your way. 24 card to inspire a positive attitude every day. So it's just like affirmations and stuff. And this one says positive affirmations, 24 cards to inspire. I cannot believe this happened when I did the video. And then these walls are so thin in apartments, you can hear it and the windows right here. These, this apartment needs new windows so bad because you can hear through it, you get a breeze through it, it's crazy. Um, but again, this is for positive affirmations and it's a really nice box, y'all. Really nice by True Story. So I was really excited to find these. Okay, I think they kind of went away a little bit. But um, I was so excited to find these. And this pink one is really, really pretty. Nope, they're still there. Okay, next, we'll go here. So I would have passed right by these, but I just glanced, I'm like, oh my God, those are the Lips gummies. This green bag by, um, it just says gummy lips made with real fruit juice. They are like lips. It's like a pale pink. We're gonna open one. It's pale pink. Hopefully they're not too chewy. I don't know. It's pale pink on this side. Oh, 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 I thought it was like one on one side, the other on that side. So we got pink and red. And y'all know I'm doing the pink and red theme with Kaya for Valentine's Day. And if we do Galentine's, I was going to put these out in a candy dip jar, which I found this random candy jar at Dollar Tree. It honestly looks like, like a pickle jar or something like that with the top. And, um, but it's by... E pure glass but it's a cute little literally it reminds me of like a pickle jar at the top but it's so cute and you can put a ribbon around it to gift it but um I'm gonna try a little piece of this I don't want to be chewing okay I'm just it's like you know what it reminds me of kind of like the texture of a Swedish fish oh yes ma'am oh my gosh but I'll show you. I got to clean this jar out before I pour them in. But a whole bunch of lips. So I got a lot. I, I don't think a lot of people know that they're lips because it's in this green bag. Mm, these are good, y'all. I was hoping they were good. I picked up a lot just because they were lips. Mm. 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 It literally tastes like a Swedish fish. Let me just see. Oh, okay. Excited for those because I'm going to decorate with them. Also, if you're doing a thing with the uh, pink and red lips, look what they had. The pink and red lip socks. So I got a couple of these for Galentine's with the little lips. 
Hopefully I'll put together and film when I set up for the little Galantines. I think Kai's supposed to have a friend that comes over and it'll just be us girls and we'll just throw a little Galantine's Day little party. Next up, and again, I got this glass jar. Next up, I found more like makeup headbands. Y'all, these look like little pandas. They have little ears and they have the pink one and it just says spa headband. And these are such good quality. Y'all know I had a flip. I flipped over the Valentine's Day one. They were such good quality. These are the cute like little panda ears. Like how cute are these? $1.25? These are adorable. So I picked up two of those. I could not believe those were there. Um, What else next? Let's see. We got some food items and then a little bit of everything, y'all. Oh, I got some of these. Let me go ahead and show you some more of the Valentine's Day stuff. I got these because if I do a charcuterie board or if I make little skewers with like mozzarella balls, tomato balls, um, basil. They had the red hearts and the pink hearts. I just think these are so cute and they're wooden. Even the red hearts are wooden on there. I was so excited to find these. They always have so much really good items um, for Valentine's Day. Next, I got this watermelon cotton candy because it's pink. I believe it's pink. And I'm going to make me a cocktail and I can make the girls like a virgin cocktail or like a little drink um, and put the pink cotton candy, put one of those little gummy lips and we can just put together a cute little drink. I can get like sparkling grape juice and then put like some type of pink lemonade or something in it i can make something up y'all i'll get creative but i'm gonna use the pink cotton candy for it so i got the pink cotton candy i found this big thing of uh, unsweetened applesauce and it's like the kids pouches but y'all it's a box of four of them if you have kids y'all jump on this even if you don't this is just unsweetened applesauce it's not like baby food it's fat free cholesterol free sodium free free of preservatives no artificial colors, no artificial flavors, gluten-free. I'm going to have to look up this brand, Carry Fruits, and see if this is something that's at like Whole Foods or something, because y'all, you get four of them, and they're like, they look like a natural little packet. Hopefully it's not getting too dark in here, y'all. When I do it in here, the lighting's always a little crazy, and my bags show like crazy. Okay, next up. This is a bunch of random stuff, y'all. Hope you don't mind. They had these in the um, like school section. They had these poster letters, and they're this pink color. And I had to get them because it's like a light pink and a dark pink, and it honestly has like iridescence to it. Metal. Oh, holographic. That's what it says, holographic. But I got these because I'm gonna do something with them on Valentine's Day, and it's good to just keep in a stash for crafting stuff. Got this other clip. I got a clip like this the other day, but it was more of like an ivory color. This actually would go perfect with this sweater I'm wearing today. These clips are so good, y'all. These are the big ones. I love these. Love them. Um, Next up, let me show you. I got this. I don't know who I'm going to give it to. I might actually, maybe my brother or his son. I'm not sure, but I had to get the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. This is a family size box, y'all, of cereal. And then they have these socks. Y'all y'all remember when I was like, don't gift a box of cereal, but you can. Um, but look, they had the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle socks and everyone loves a good sock. Uh, even grown men loves a colorful, fun sock. Like how cute is that? And they go together. I'm always, I can't help myself. If I'm in the store and I see if something goes together, I'm grabbing it. I mean, and these are thick, y'all. These are thick socks. They are so cute. So I picked them up. It'll go to somebody who will appreciate it. It'll go to somebody. Um, next up, I got another box of these. Kaya loved them, and they're convenient and easy. Great after-school snack. And the Twisted Noodle brand, she said these are really good. So I picked them up another if I see in there I'm gonna grab them because that's a good snack for $1.25 also I'm gonna be making some um Caesar chicken salads like grilled chicken Caesar that's how you say it grilled chicken Caesar salads and I saw these croutons and this is a 50 20 percent more and this actually has the zip at the top right here so once you open it you can zip it and it stays good so I haven't actually tasted these but they look good and I'm gonna do the one where you crunch 
them up so you have like croutons throughout the salad. So I cannot wait. I've been craving a grilled chicken Caesar salad for a minute. Those, I used to get them all the time, y'all. Grilled chicken Caesar salad used to be my favorite. Also grab some mangoes. I used to buy these all the time. If y'all have been with me for a long time, you know. I used to buy these diced mangoes all the time. I'm, I might make some type of mango salsa to go over some salmon, like a, a fruit, like little pico de gallo type thing to go over some salmon or even maybe a chicken dish. And then I wanna make a mango sauce. So like drizzle it with the sauce and then do, should I show y'all that when I do it? And then make like a, a mango pico de gallo type thing. But they have the mango nectar these juices are always really good. They're kind of thick, but I'm going to make a sauce with it. So I thought I saw these two. And I was like, yep, that's exactly. I got inspired to make a mango fish dish. Either I'll do like a salmon or salmon or like a cod or something like that. I'm not sure, but I'm going to figure it out. It always mango pairs well with salmon. So does pineapple so good or shrimp or a shrimp dish yes i could do a mango shrimp dish i could do that um i got some unsweetened applesauce i had bought this before i found this but i love when i can find the all natural it's all natural unsweetened applesauce i love applesauce y'all and it's a weird thing that i do pretzels dipped in applesauce is so good i don't even know where i got that from how one day i just dipped it but i take like those stick Snyder's pretzels and I dip it like it's a dip and eat it with pretzels. It's the weirdest thing, but it's actually really good. So I picked up some of these just to have, you never know when you crave some applesauce, you never know. Got more of my tunas. I got the cracked black pepper this time and the sweet chili. Y'all, I'm obsessed with tuna and I'm obsessed with tuna bowls and I'm just, I'm a, I love it. I literally love it. I at least have it twice a week. So just keep it up. I just keep it in there to snack on. Even with crackers, I'll snack on it. I got, oh, for the Galentines, because they don't have like a balloon that says Galentines. They have a balloon that says love, and they have a balloon in the baby shower section that says girl. So I'm gonna, and it's bright pink. So I'm gonna hang like girl and then love, and then so it's like a girly Valentine's, Galentine's Day thing. But I picked this up. I thought it'd be really cute for whatever we decide we're going to do. Still don't know exactly, but we're going to do something. Um, I found this bowl. And it is not a Dollar Tree brand. It is by Meritage. Meritage. M-E-R-I-T-A-G-E. Because -E. that's not Mirage. Mirage? Is it Mirage? It could be. But um, it, this is the... This is it but I just really liked it. It's not like a huge bowl. When I make my tuna bowls, this would be perfect. I, I just like the shape of it. And they just had just these random, not a set or anything, just random bowls. I like the like ombre look of it. I just like it. This looks like a perfect tuna bowl or a little ramen bowl. Picked up some of these for candy at the Galentine's Day. Um, thing. They're just the red strips. These are good. Called candy squares. They're good. And then I picked up um, some sour noodles. I thought these were cute. I just saw them like, what in the world? How cute that would be if you gifted a bowl with like some noodles. But this looks cute. And it's not by a brand. Um, what is the brand that I've seen at Dollar Tree? It just says sour noodles made with fruit juice. They all say made with fruit juice, which is nice. Um, so we're going to give it a try. I just thought this was cute. Thought it was cute. It's got the little chopsticks and everything. Love it. Okay. So more candy because it's Valentine's day y'all. So don't judge me now. I picked up these. I have not had chocolate covered cherries in a very long time. I know they're best when they're in the refrigerator and cause the sauce around it thickens up and they're really good. These are definitely smaller than they used to carry at Dollar Tree. They definitely have cut down on how many you get. Whoa, you only get five pieces. I know back in the day, y'all, these were definitely bigger and thicker. But I got the milk chocolate one, not the dark chocolate. The milk chocolate, I was so excited to find these. And I haven't had it, so I said, you know what? Let me get some cherries. Why not? For myself for Valentine's Day. Um, I picked up the boys a Valentine's Day card because Cayman um, is away, as you know. He is in another state working. 
in the Air Force. So I wanted to send him something. Um, I need to hurry up and send these too. But I thought this was so cute. First of all, it's a Hallmark, Hallmark card. And it says, I love you. And you see the little dinosaur, right? It just, it's so cute. Then when you open it, it says, thankfully, my love reaches farther than my arms, which is perfect because he's not in the same state. And since he no longer lives here, you know, like it's trying to make fun of because like a T-Rex's arms are short and I'm short too. So it kind of makes sense, but it just says, thankfully my love reaches farther than my arms because I can't actually hug him, but my love reaches to him. I thought this was perfect. And it says, happy Valentine's Day. Y'all don't go anywhere else for cards. Have y'all been to like a regular store and seen card prices lately? No, ma'am. Only Dollar Tree. And they're nice and they're cute. Like this is actually a really cute card and it's Hallmark. But I got two because Cash don't live here either. So I got one for him. Um, I just thought it was really cute. So I want to send them a Valentine's Day. Y'all know I got to always do a little something. A little something. So I got them a card. I got these for my stash in my bathroom. And y'all know I'm going for that. I'm, I'm still going to be doing that video of organizing my bathroom and buying my stash. But I got a couple extra razors for if we have company or if we go, if we travel somewhere and you just need a razor to take with you. These are the big Silky Touch, the three razor, like it has three razor blades and it's the pink color. I'm telling you, I'm going to organize my bathroom. It's going to be so pink and so cute. Got another coloring book for when we do Galentine's because I have the rainbow high one. I wanted to get real girly one. So I got the rainbow high one and the Barbie. So we might do that. I don't know. We're just going to do girly stuff, y'all. And now we're going to watch some girly movies. Just probably like Girls Trip or just some real girly movies. So we're going to do that. Um, Next. Oh, I found these mints. Cotton candy mints. And y'all remember the big, I wanted to taste these. This is what they look like. And this is the same. I love the peppermint ones. They are so good. I keep them in my car. But I saw cotton candy. I'm like, a cotton candy mint? So we're about to try this out, y'all. I just love it. I love the look of it. Y'all see that? And it's a really nice, it's like an Altoids tin with, oh my gosh. Y'all know what? This, okay. I'm showing my age, but a while like when I was younger, teenage, teenage, maybe a little older, Jessica Simpson had a perfume line, but it was like, you can almost eat it too. Like it was like a sweet, like if you sprayed it, you could like eat it. It was like a sweet treat, like perfume brand, or I know she has perfume, but it was like a body spray type brand that she had. It was sweet something. But she had a cotton candy scent that was my absolute favorite scent. I wish she still carried that. It made you smell so good. It wasn't your average cotton candy smell. It genuinely, you genuinely smelled like such a sweet, just good smell. That's what, when you open this, this is the exact way that that perfume smelled. Not perfume, it was a body spray that was like glittery. Okay. So it does have like, like a mint with cotton candy. That's not bad, y'all. Oh, man. I like that. That It goes together. I don't know how it goes together, but it goes together. Next up, I had to buy a couple more of these clips that I got Kaya last time. The rhinestone. Her friends liked them. They were like, where did you get those from? Kaya's like, my mama got them from Dollar Tree. And she just, she put them in her hair. They're so cute. She put them like on the sides. And they're just clips with rhinestones on them. So I got a couple if she wanted to give her friends any. Um, but they're so cute. And they have different colors. But the black with the rhinestones is just a classic you can wear with anything. Got a couple things of black olives. I've been on a black olive kick lately, y'all. Don't know why. I have no idea why. I just got on it. And then I found this box of heavy-duty trash bags by Handy Wrap. So I got to try them. They just came in this weird, like, packaging. There's 12 bags. I just want to see how good they are. 26-gallon heavy-duty trash bags. Is Handy Wrap their normal brand? I don't think so, y'all. I think that's a name brand. Yeah, because it's not Greenbrier. But um, I want to give them a try. Why not? Or I can give them the cash. Maybe he needs some trash bags for his house. 
But um, I think that's it, y'all. That's it. I know it's like candies and Valentine's Day stuff, but I love sharing that with you guys too. Because if you're throwing a party or you're trying to get somebody Valentine's Day stuff, love to share it with you guys. You know, sometimes it's just the basic regular stuff. But I'm so excited about those lips, these. And tell me that's not cute. So repackage it though. Definitely if you gift it, repackage it in like a little container. And you can gift the matching socks with the little lips. This, I'm so excited. So excited. And I can write Kaya's name. I can do this and put Kaya's name on. Um, or I can do Galentine's. I can spell Galentine's. Yes, I can. That could go good on a... um. A banner, not a banner, yeah, a garland, like the banner thing. I can put Galantines with this and still put up the girl, the girl balloon and everything. But that's it, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys have a wonderful day today, and I will see you on my next video. Bye, y'all. Love y'all.